In this video, I'm gonna take you through how to perform the rear foot elevated split squat. So the rear foot elevated split squat is amongst one of my favorite leg strength exercises. It is incredible for developing single leg strength, particularly about the hip and the knee joint. There are many ways in which you can perform this drill, whether that be with a kettlebell underneath the chin, known as the goblet variation, two kettlebells underneath the chin in what is called the rack position, dumbbells by your side, a barbell on your back, or if you've got pre-existing shoulder problems, you can also use a safety bar. Now the main coaching cues for this are that you maintain a nice upright neutral trunk. This will involve you locking your rib cage down and preventing you from exposing your rib cage or overextending at your lower back. This is incredibly important because too much of an emphasis on the extension in the lower back can have detrimental effects on the pelvis. So locking your rib cage down nice and tight using the abdominals will ensure that you've got a nice neutral posture. As well as that, you want a nice straight line going through the shoulder, the hip, and the knee joint of the leg that is elevated behind you. To get the benefits of flexibility through the front foot, or more specifically the ankle joint, you want a nice narrow stance to make sure that your knee of the front foot is going forward of the toes. As always, thank you for watching this video. Please do hit the subscribe button below, hit the bell icon to get notified of our next release, and I'll see you soon.